What's going on, minions? It's Chris Kamikaze here once again, and uh, this time around, I'm going to bring you the NECA Borderlands Claptrap figure. Um, this is a nice little piece, especially if you are fans of Borderlands. I've been playing Borderlands 2 actually for the past two days. It's a fun game featuring this guy right here, Claptrap. Um, first off, I'm going to point out there's this cool little drawer here. It's the little warning drawer that actually opens, attracts. It's actually got some pretty good distance. You can read that there. Warning. <laughs> going to close that. Then uh, we're going to flip around here. He has a movable antenna. Goes down. When he's scared, pops back up. When he's all happy to see you, starts dancing. Um, he has relatively good articulation. He's a very detailed figure, actually. You know, you'll see markings that you saw from the first Borderlands. You know, there's part of uh, some of his cracked, damaged bits there from getting beat up by raiders and everything. Um... Nice little back here, very nice detailing on the paneling. Um, his little escape drawer. Uh, there is this hole for the peg there for his stand, which is also a very nice stand. We'll get to that here in a minute. Um, overall, this doesn't have a lot of articulation, obviously. He's a box with a wheel, so um, you get some articulation here in his little arm flaps. Uh, you get this front flap here. His eye does move around. Um, it's a little tight. It's just a ball sitting in there. Um, he's got movement here in his little foot wheel area for uh, hoisting kind of uh, shocks, if you will. Um, he does have some movement. He can go, obviously, he can go 360. He can go out. It's just you got to be very careful with it. It is a very tight joint in there, and he has joint movement in his arms. His hands don't move, but you know what? That's not a problem. I think this figure is just really awesome. He's really well detailed. Really cool looking figure. You can tell he's got a little caution things. Uh, I'm going to put him down for a second. Uh, I take it as his base. It comes on. He just sits on a little uh, L bracket there. It just plugs into the back there where this hole in the back is right there. Um, it's also very detailed. Uh, you have, you know, cracked sand and earth. You can got the tri tread marks here from his tire. You know, some rocks and everything. Um, you know, this is a, definitely a figure worth picking up. If you guys happen to be able to find Claptrap, uh, definitely pick him up. They're going to be doing another run of them since Borderlands 2 just came out last month, or the beginning of the month. Um, last month time. So, you know, hopefully a cool, something else cool would be cool to see is uh, NECA put out... Uh, you know, some of the other characters, such as, you know, like, Zero, Salvador, you know, the newer characters. And uh, do another paint of this guy would be pretty awesome. You know, maybe throw in some other features. And, uh, all in all, guys, I think this is a pretty awesome figure. If you happen to be a chance to find him, pick him up. Uh, this is the NECA version of Claptrap. So, all right, guys, uh, thanks for taking your time for watching. And uh, we'll see you guys again real soon. All right, there he is. Peace.